Good morning, Sagittarius. Welcome to Sag and Sun. Let's see what messages we got for y'all this morning. What time is it? Nine fifty two. Damn. I ain't gonna be giving no biscuit. <laughs> All right, spirit, what's going on for Sagittarius today? Please and thank you. What messages of divine guidance? Look at that. Ten of Swords to the Nine of Swords. Oh my goodness, goodness. Seven of Swords? This could be family. Ten of Cups. Alright, let's see what's going on. Spirit, what messages do you have for my Sagittarius? Please and thank you. Alright, these two want to come out. Look at that. Ooh, wee! Baby, whatever they doing, go on let them do it, child. Uh, Queen of Wands with the Ten of Pentacles. Y'all. Wow. I don't know what's going on right here, but it, ooh, it could be about work. With the Eight of Pentacles, some of y'all about to get something. It's, it's going to happen fast, too. The Knight of Swords. Just acting nowhere. Some of you guys may get recognized or something. You know how people be, I mean, social media. You might say something could go viral. You might upload a video and it go viral. Or you might do a little TikTok. You playing with your, your kids or your, your friends. You upload a little TikTok. Remember that woman who said, my lord, it's a snapping turtle. When she said that, she wasn't thinking about the whole world finna hit that for real, for real. Huh? That's what it looked like right here. Something that you're working on, Eight of Pentacles, okay, is about to bring you the Ten of Pentacles. Wow. All right. Let's get the Kipper. We're going to pull the Kipper. We're going to pull these, the green card. And this about to happen fast. I don't feel like you see it. Nobody is seeing this coming. It's just... And that's why I'm saying it's got to be something online. Something. You said something and then boom, it's air well. Everybody talking about it. All right, Spirit, what's going on? Message of concern. Oh, pathway. What else? journey ain't no problem with number equation official person expectation thoughts courtship this is and then main female okay so this is definitely something to do with work. Or maybe this is how this person... Because it can... Okay, it could come out two ways. What they call it is? There it is right there. And that's what this is saying. So for some of you, this could be a relationship, right? And maybe maybe they met you at work. The Queen of Wands is undeniable. The Queen of Wands is... I don't know why I'm getting competitive. Maybe you are very competitive. Um, but I feel like you're very confident... There's somebody wants to see more. All right, let me, let me tell you what I'm getting. You see how she got on this long ass moo moo dress? You can't see nothing. Her toes, her knees, nothing. But this person is very attracted to you for whatever it is that they do see. They have a lot of respect for you, but they want to see more. They feel like there's more in you, okay? Um, whether this is a job or a relationship, they feel like there's more to come out. So what I'm seeing Official person, expectations, thoughts, courtship. This is partnership for others of you. This is romantic. Now, they looking at you. Now, this man, is. this could be a man or a woman. And you could be a man or a woman. Y'all, it's just energy that I'm picking up on. 444 on the phone. This person sitting at their desk and they in their thoughts about you. Now, I just said in another reading, this person could have been confused about your energy before. But that 16 is breaking down to a 7. So it's telling me that this person is seeing something from 
a higher perspective. Some of you guys are being evaluated for something. Okay. Now, expectations and official person. For some of you, where this is romantic, they may be older than you. And they could, maybe they want to take care of you or something like that, y'all. The cards say, though you're not rich, you're going to be living comfortable. Y'all need to go watch the reading that I just put on my main channel. Because this card came out too. Okay, but let's look at this message of concern. Pathway and journey. Somebody getting ready to come towards you. What? Spirit, what the message of concern? Ooh. Shit. The Nine of Wands with the Ten of Cups. The Nine of Wands is a very passionate go getter. They might be young and. But this, this night going some places. Because I feel like this official person is older than you. I feel like it's you. Or they could have watched you go from this night to the queen. I don't know, y'all. But they seen you like this. Ten of Cups. How is that a message of concern? Maybe somebody else getting a message of concern. I do look at this. Ten of Wands. So maybe you're doing something all by yourself. You could be... The Ten of Wands, that's a lot of burdens to carry. Okay. But look, it's coming. That the Ace of Pentacles. For some of you, something could have happened to a family member with the Ten of Cups. I don't feel like that though. What I'm getting off this message of concern is some of y'all ain't gonna believe this. You got the, the damn ace of pentacles, which is huge. This is this is coming straight from the hand of the divine. This is huge. And it leads you to the 10. 717 on the phone. And I feel like it's something, either this person met you at work or something that you working on. It could even be something that they working on. But somebody want to give you some type of offer here. And so... That's going to be the message of concern. Some of y'all going to be like, why me? Some of you guys might even have to move to take uh, this opportunity here. There's a card in there to say when opportunity presents itself, don't get stuck in doubt. Because some of y'all going to be like, me? What's wrong with me? Why me? You could you could be, you could give this to anybody. Why would you give it to me? You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all going to be like that. What else, spirit? The star, tower, and the freaking ace of cups. Child, listen. Whatever the fuck this is, baby. It's real. It's live. Some of y'all really might become. I just got to listen to that song, The King's Affirmation. She said, I will be one of the greatest. You got a fucking official ass person. This person is official as hell. And they see something in you. They've been looking at you. Like I say, I do feel like they was confused at first. like, But they still feel like it's more to uncover with you. You know, maybe they feel like you're not showing your all or giving your all. That's what I was getting with this big ass dress you got on. Like, let me see them kneecaps. Show me something. Yeah. And now, uh, some of you guys could be a high priestess. I just saw the high priestess card. Let's put in the green cards and see, you know, what the hell goes on. This is this is good. It may have came from somebody's family. Could have also been putting you up under this stress. Ten of cups to the ten of wands. <coughs> you know how people don't be thinking you, because I did a reading a while back where I said these people don't feel like you belong. I sure did. And that could be what this is. They could be looking at you like a knight of wands. It don't matter how the fuck they see you. This person see you as this queen of wands. Okay? And they feel like there's more there. Most most women have to show a titty, a nipple, or something to get some type of attention. Everything is covered on you. You can't even see a toe. Huh? 
all they see is your neck and your damn face. So for those of you where this is a relationship, at least you know they like you for you. But that's going to shock some of y'all. Like, what? This a fish-ass person want me? Look at that shit. Next level, be a boss. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And so there's a chance for something extra. Then you got the destiny card with the leadership card. Come on, spirit. These folks ain't listening. And look, but I'm, I'm going to shuffle. Let me shuffle because this came out in the last read now. I told you that with the Eight of Pentacles, it say something you've been working on about to be very profitable. That was the Eight of Pentacles right there. Mm -mm -mm. The Rebel. Okay. So some of y'all could have said something. Ruffle some feathers. I don't know, child. But uh, it says you are a trailblazer, meant to see things differently and set a new path for others. And that's kind of what I was talking about in the last reading. Times is changing. Things is changing, you know. And, you know, whether this is a company, a business, or whatever, maybe people want new and innovative ideas, that freshness. Maybe you bring that freshness, okay? And whatever you bring in, they know you got more. That's really what I'm getting with this Queen of Wands. Maybe something, you know, if there was options, maybe the other person, they played the hand, or maybe they they came in with the titties showing. It's like they showed, they did everything they had. They don't have no, no more cards to play. But with you, it's like, I know this person got more, they got more. It's something else up under there. So, I don't know. Y'all got to take how it resonates. So, your rebellious spirit makes you a great system buster to teach others a better way. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Maybe, it's, you know, maybe you have a different perspective on things. Maybe you see things differently. But I feel like it was something that you said because this person reading the newspaper. And they're like, did you hear that shit? <laughs> now, here's my card where I tell you, you know, this person. What? Well, that could be the official ass person. When this card comes out, I say somebody who's very good at what to do want to take you up under their wing. The card just says careers in counseling, psychic work, or energy healing may appeal to you. Then you got this charity right here. Humanitarian work, human rights, justice, or advocacy work could be just right for you. And then you could receive money from some type of legal matter. They could also be with that damn Ten of Pentacles in. Cause that's not little. That that ten that's big. That in tarot, that's the most you can get. And the ten of pentacles is symbolic to like generational wealth. Okay. So if you've been going back and forth to court, or if there's something going on in court, you might receive money from a legal matter. I don't know. I just this is crazy. Look at that. The office? No, hell no. That's not what the cards say, but that's what I got off of that. Some of y'all have the attention of some big motherfuckers. Some big motherfuckers. Okay? But I'm going to read the card. That's not what I'm... The card says, consider careers in administrative or management. But that ain't what I got. It's some... It's A. Hey, baby. But we just gonna keep it small. Cause sometimes maybe I'm reading too much into it. But anyway, it says trust. The universe is asking you to trust that your needs will be met. There is a spiritual reason why you are experiencing this cycle. This is also a good time to connect with your spirit guides. Somebody has been stealing or lying to you about money. Mm. But be a sport, cause it's all gonna work out in the end. The offer coming to you, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups. This is also favor being shown over your life when you think about these. Both of these cups are coming straight from the divine. So, that's favor. Go watch my other reading, 1444 on the phone. Some of you guys could be designers. Maybe that's why they pointed out the dress. I don't know. 
Of course, it's going to be different for all y'all. Okay. Real estate. So, for some of you, it's saying build a solid foundation prior to building several stories above it. Consider careers in real estate, interior design, architecture, or any home business. Some of you guys may work from home with that Eight of Pentacles right there. But, baby, I just said favor being shown over your life. Angelic help. Yeah. And so this card is saying there is a career or a blessing lining up for you. Stay positive and believe. Because with the Ten of Wands, you really could be stressed. Or, you know, you the Ten of Wands is doing it all by yourself. And when people get to the 10, they get ready to give up. 1555 on the phone. But right when you're getting ready, you know, this came out the other day. Right when you get ready to give up, boom. Some type of offer comes through. And this offer is going to put you to where you're not doing it all by yourself no more. With the Ten of Wands, you'll be living comfortable. For some of you, it's just a relationship. Someone could want to, like, take care of you. For others of you, it's some type of a job offer. Either way, you're about to enter the most comfortable period of your life. It's just the truth of it. Angelic help. Now, you got this fear card. Overcome your fear of success or failure. Don't sabotage your own success. Don't allow your fear to make you forget your greatness. Remain positive and on track. For a lot of you, this may require you to step outside your comfort zone. That could also be the message of concern. Some of y'all might really be shocked at who this official-ass person is. But it says, see, with this persistence, your efforts have not gone unnoticed. Success is just around the corner. You've been working hard at something. Ten of Wands, Eight of Pentacles, still in the Queen of Wands energy. You know, still being confident, still getting up and doing it. Whatever you've been doing, whether you're a man or a woman, it's about to pay out for you. Yep, right after this is the offering. Okay? <clears throat> I wonder what this legal thing is. This, okay, so you got designer, a career in fashion, art, or any artistic endeavor could be just right for you. Um, some of you guys are being called to tune into your own individuality and express it. I'm also getting that too with this Queen of Wands, because for some of you, where well, this is a relationship, you know how some women be trying to throw themselves on people. You are all the way covered up. It reminds me of that song, um... By CeeLo and Outkast. It's called Beautiful Black Skin. I think that's the name of it. He said, when I look at you, I see my reflection. So I offer my love, affection, and protection. Okay? Mm. All right. That's, that's some powerful shit. Some sexy shit right there. I don't know how it gonna resonate for y'all. But baby. What's this? Motivator. So there's a skill that you possess that needs to be shared with the world. Consider a career in coaching, speaking, lobbying, activism, or mentoring. Y'all, this same energy came out in, in the last reading. What's at the bottom of the deck? Men what needs mending. It says you have the ability to easily fix your finances, but a sacrifice may be needed. Some of y'all may have to move right here. Okay, with this explore. You may be called to explore careers that match your fearlessness and curiosity. That's the type of energy that I'm getting off this Queen of Wands. I heard competitive. That's why I said some of y'all might be competitive. All right, you have voice. So get your messages heard, get noticed. You have much to share with the world. Consider careers in radio, public relations. You know, now that's a little weird because... Somebody's looking at how, okay, somebody did something in a short amount of time or something like that. 
maybe whatever this is that you've been working on, maybe you ain't been working on it that long. I don't know. But they see something else in you. Okay, then for some of y'all, but I don't see that. I was finna say somebody might have a job loss, but I don't see that. I just see you being like favorites coming. Favor coming in here for you. Yeah, look at that. Your luck is about to change. Now I see this unrealistic and then your luck. And so it's going back to the, the, the same movie that I referenced in my reading on my other channel. The movie Freedom Riders, okay? She said her methods are unrealistic and she can't do that with every class. And it was something about, they was trying to make some rules. They wanted, the students wanted to be able to go with that teacher all the way to, well, they just wanted to be able to go with her to the next year, but they made it to where she could go with them all the way to the 12th grade. And it was because she was making a difference. But it was a bunch of people saying that her methods were unrealistic. Maybe something that you're saying or doing is working cause the card says your luck is about to change for the better. You're going to get a lucky breakthrough or a financial breakthrough. It also says anything you do now will be very prosperous for you. So, baby. Some of you guys could be artists, entertainers, but this is how you're looking right now. Right? This manifesting. It says you have all the tools that you need to increase your income. Good fortune is coming to you soon and an opportunity may come where you can showcase your talent. Whatever you work on could be a talent of yours. And somebody, somebody might want you to, I don't know, it says the opportunity may come where you can showcase it. Maybe they want you to teach it to them. That could also be what that is. Whatever you do is gonna be different for all of y'all, okay? Is there anything else, Spirit? Mm -hmm. Mechanic. So, again, men, what needs mending? Some of y'all might have to make a sacrifice. But I don't see how. Maybe you've had to. With that Ten of Wands, maybe you've had to do it out a lot. Or just the fact that you've had to do it all by yourself. That's changing. You, you can go from single to some type of partnership. Some of y'all may even be put in a position where you don't even have to work. She don't know why she's doing much but drinking that damn coffee. I don't know. It's going to be different for all of y'all. It's, it's a next level. Next level type stuff. Okay. So let me get y'all an angel message. Because there's going to be more details in my main reading. Because this type of energy just came out in the last reading. And so... We ain't gonna keep repeating. But I swear y'all when this when this office card came out, I was getting like <laughs> the head motherfucker in charge. Some of y'all can have that attention. I don't know. It's they official as fuck. You know that okay, you remember the movie The Bodyguard? You remember that scene where they was in that wasn't the White House that they was in. I think it was. What, what was they talking about? That's just what I'm getting. That's what that building looked like, that scene in the movie. And this person right here. So, I mean, it do say they official. Some of you may even be surprised as to what the hell been going on. I don't know what their message of concern is. But something's about to be over. Ten of Wands with this ten on this journey card. Hmm. And this this motherfucker right here is striped all the way up. They got a medal for every damn thing. Okay, so this person could be older than you. I don't know. It's going to be different for all y'all. But they say angelic help. So this is the time to trust in the universe. You know you're going to be provided for. There's a career or a blessing lining up for you. Stay positive and believe. And pay attention to any signs that your angels are sending you during this time. Look at that shit right there. Ooh, 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 ooh. Windfall. 
Is that not the damn Ten of Pentacles? Huh? It said you're about to receive a windfall of money or a pay raise. Because for some of y'all could get a job offer. Some of y'all may be able to make a big ass purchase. It says this is a great time to treat yourself and make a big purchase. This could be enough for you to buy a home. Or it, it could be life changing. The tower is also life changing. So baby. Get ready, get ready. Go on claim it and go on thank the most high God for it right now. Even if you don't see nothing happening. Go on thank God for it right now. Now I'm getting that song. Making million dollar deals on a cell phone. Mm -mm -mm. So I don't know what y'all getting ready to get into, but baby. It's big. This is big. Remind me of that dream I had a couple weeks ago with my damn um we was at a family gathering. And they had to put something in my damn drink. And my uncle grabbed me by my arm, squeezing the fuck out my arm. And my cousin grabbed me by the other arm. And they walked me into this closet. And they said, you ain't been answering your damn email. I want some of that damn money. I'm looking at him like, what fucking, what money? What are you talking about? And all I remember was, like, I knew what was going on. But I couldn't fight back. Whatever the fuck they had put in my drink. I couldn't fight that, so I hope that's not for nobody, but that's just what that reminded me of, just a little bit. But let's get y'all an angel message. Spirit. Mm -hmm. Throat chakra. So it really could be something that you said. It says the angels are helping you to lovingly speak your truth. Okay, emotional sensitivity. Honor and respect your deep sensitivity as it is a gift to us all. <clears throat> Let us be now I'm getting that scene out the movie uh hidden figures when that woman went to court and um this was back in the 60s now that little speech that she gave to the judge she said out of all the cases you're gonna hear today which one I'm gonna matter which one I'm gonna matter in a hundred years from now so he was the first judge to approve her to go to an all-white school to get the education. And she was the first black girl to go to the all-white school to get the education. She also became the first African-American what engineer in that department at NASA. Something like that could be going on for some of y'all. I don't know what y'all are doing, but baby. What else, spirit? Look at that shit, mediumship. Some of y'all have the natural ability. I did say that because I saw the high priestess. Some of y'all have the natural ability to connect with departed loved ones. Um, so you remember how that person was holding the newspaper? If you are a medium, y'all know what that is. Like people could come through and talk. Maybe somebody loved one came through and said something. People could be like, well, how did you know that? You wouldn't have known that. I don't know. I don't know what this is. Okay, what else, spirit? Ooh, ooh. All right, so this is the same card came out in the last reading. A chance meeting with this new partner. A chance meeting is no mistake. It was divinely orchestrated as a catalyst to set the wheels in motion to answer your prayer, okay? Um, it says books. Some of you guys may write a book. This person could be a writer. I don't know, but your life purpose involves writing, reading, editing, or selling spiritually based books. You also have the law of attraction with acceptance. Mm. It says, see yourself and other and others through the eyes of the angels with unconditional love and acceptance. So, when I when I get this card. You know, I explain it to y'all all the time. There's regular people right there. And they're looking up at these angels in the sky. But these people don't see these two earth angels standing down there with them. You see what I'm saying? Just look at the card for a minute. Y'all tell me what y'all get out of it. Leave it in the comments. Okay? So that's what I have for y'all, man. Like, this is good news coming through. And it could come after you been through a lot in your life what that is the hermit some of you guys could be like a, a guru or something the hermit is a like a spiritual teacher 
Nine of Cups. I just said a guru. Seven of Wands. What the seven? What's, and the moon. Somebody could be guarding something or protecting something, defending something from behind the scenes. What's this? Nine of Pentacles. Okay. Either way, that's that other card of entering the most comfortable period of your life. It's right there. All right, y'all. That's what I have for you. Till next time. Bye.